a suggestion would be to you is not to open a physical clinic because are you able to hear me? Okay, one more. My suggestion to you would be not to open a physical clinic but act open a virtual clinic what what that will do is because there are thousands of clinics in these countries and they are inequipped they are inadequately informed they are in the wrong mindset also so uh, once you are aware of all of them located so you can instead of building one clinic you can build a platform which connects everybody together using the technology using the internet you can identify them you can gps mark them you can make them the data available to common people easily which will allow uh, more people to access to the existing clinic and improve the service quality of the existing clinic rather than creating something all together and it will take you 2 3 years to start one clinic rather than that sitting where you are you act as a bridge among the developers the software developers the clinics the volunteers and you act as someone as a ceo or who, who is connecting everything going through all this data analyzing and analyzing because uh, the best that's what i see you as a position of so by doing this by hearing the problem from the people and by hearing the problem from the clinics and getting the correct abstract out of it and then solving those problem will be the best thing you can do and it will scale in millions and billions of people rather than one clinic i mean you can do both but this is my suggestion using using the technology using a smartphone using a device which everybody has today and in india they are launching a 4 dollar smartphone next month which will mean that every single person in the country will have a smartphone That's in the good. next in the next few years they will be on the internet so all you have to develop is something like an app which will allow them to connect to these services rather than creating one clinic you can become a virtual clinic connector and a beacon which actually impacts much 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 more people than you can ever imagine i think it's an excellent idea uh, i i do still believe the one clinic would help in a rural area but getting in touch with the with the current clinics that are going on now need that education need that uh, feedback of how how severe rabies can really be timely manner all this uh yes i do agree that it needs to be out there because it helps uh, in places not just the one clinic but it helps all over the place and i don't know and if it's global and i don't know if it was god's work or something i only created yesterday a group called i am from kirinagar and i have also joined another group which has 14000 people who are living in sirinagar so i will be happy to introduce you to that group you can add yourself you can post this video which i am posting over there so the volunteers can come in and help you and understand you very quickly what exactly is it needed for them to do and okay. and use those resources as a connector because um you know there is a deficiency of trust among people in the third world countries and underdeveloped countries and the one thing they trust is american people they trust americans a lot they think all americans are billionaires the millionaires they, you have deep pockets and you can shove in and you can give them a million dollars which will not happen i'm sure but uh but you they still the trust factor is still there and you can take it as a leverage uh to go and ask them to do certain things which they will not do for me but they will do for you instantaneously then, then on top of that we have more respect for women in our countries both of us so uh-huh. if a man asks something most men don't do action whereas if a woman asks the same thing it's done so you have multiple advantages to take advantage of being an american being white being blonde being you know a woman just helps i'm not taking it you in a bad way but i'm just saying these are your advantages of being who you are and take advantage of being who you are is the best thing you can do if we, if i was a butterfly and i wasn't taking advantage of my wings it would be stupid i would you know just that's what i'm saying we god created us for a purpose the way we are and you are muslim on top of that oh my god so american muslim and white man and wow they would just listen to you instantaneously and take advantage of this trust which they have will they will have instantaneously with you uh and and leverage it and 
get more and more people to connect to you so that you become the mother teresa you become the the voice of rabies i mean that's all you need to do we need a beacon a radio which transmits information to all of us that's true. It's and communication yeah and you just help them connect to each other which they are not able to do right now on their own and that's a big wow. problem you can you can solve that for them this could communicate through all the clinics uh the you problems become, that they're having you become the be- you become the bridge in among the clinics the there is a as i said there is a mistrust in our cultures so we don't want yeah. to talk to each other we don't trust each other it's just we don't so but they will trust you and you can they both parties will trust you but you can connect them together and then they will become buddies that's your I job see. so you can take it, yeah so you can take advantage as the glue you can become the catalyst of leveraging all of them together very easily very easily much better than i can much better than anybody else can i see okay that is a um that's my two cents on where i need to go um uh, as well uh very important they they need that communication uh they need me as like a i guess a mentor to communicate to each other what's needed you just uh, because listen to them the locals out. are hurting yeah hear them out and you can solve problems for them just by cleaning up the language just by understanding acting as a mediator in between two parties you will do much more effectiveness than actually trying to build a clinic here itself because that is more challenging than what i am suggesting you to do all of them are on facebook all of them are on skype all of them are on whatsapp they will love to talk to you they will love to tell you their problems record the problems just like i am recording and broadcast the problems and then people will come up with ideas you just sit back and relax and talk to them more people that's all i mean the problems and solution are both with them they're just not talking to each other money is right. there talent is there technology is there they just not talking to each other this is weird very good i will work on this and that is a, a best advice i could have gotten all day today i do appreciate it i know you're very tired and i won't be on your time anymore uh especially at this hour uh but that's very valuable what you gave me and i do appreciate that you're welcome thank you for doing what you have chosen to do and uh whenever you have time i would love to hear your story who are you because it builds trust among people if you have time sure. now i would be happy to hear that now i mean a brief story